What's going on guys, it's your average consumer and today we are introducing a brand new series, awesome but overpriced tech. And today's culprit is this guy right here. This is the Sierra Modern Home Smart Speaker Coffee Table thing. Don't get me wrong, this thing is absolutely awesome and we'll talk about price a little bit later but let's talk about all the cool things that this thing can do. Now, as you guys can see, this thing is an awesome looking coffee table. It's got a nice dark walnut look to it. And it also has like this nice gray stitching. Uh, it looks really good. It really fits with the aesthetic of kind of what we're doing in this little studio. It looks awesome and it's a cool coffee table. It works as you would expect a coffee table to. Now there is another color with more of like a veneer uh, wood look to it and this is the other one now I initially picked this one up at first uh, I honestly this doesn't fit with what I was looking for but it's not a bad looking coffee table uh, but this one I think this one right here this one just looks amazing okay so you're sitting you got your nice coffee table on the side it fits with the aesthetic of your room now what makes it special besides it just being a coffee table well, there's some really cool tech that we gotta talk about. Now, I know you see these buttons over here, and that's because this table has a built-in Bluetooth speaker. So it can connect to your phone or any other Bluetooth device, and you can stream music right from the coffee table. And what's awesome is that this thing gets crazy loud, has some great bass, and vocals come in really clearly. Let me show you guys what I'm talking about. So first of all, shout out to Spider-Man, enter the Spider-Verse. Now that's not even anywhere close to max volume, but check it out. I don't know if this doesn't translate well over video, but I'm telling you guys, it gets loud. Now these are one of those speakers where even if you bring the volume all the way up on your phone, you're gonna wanna control it here as well, it's separate. But it gets so loud and there's a lot of bass. This is a pretty big room. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it is a large room and it is loud enough to completely fill it all by itself. Now, not only does it work with Bluetooth, but it also has an aux port in the back. So if there's a device that you guys wanna have plugged into it, you can just plug in the aux cable right here. Um, but as you guys can see here, there are a couple other things in the back here as well. Of course, you have a DC in. This is where you actually plug it into the wall. And as you guys can see here, this thing is functioning without that. And that's because this thing has a built-in battery. This one right here has a 6,600 milliamp hour battery inside of it. And I believe there's a 13,000 milliamp hour version as well. So you can pick the capacity that you need. So if you really care about your aesthetic and you don't wanna see a black cable plugged into this guy, you can always unplug it, still listen to your music and access all of the features that this thing has, which is awesome. Now, having that built-in battery is awesome for a few reasons. You have two USB ports over here. So that means that this thing is going to be able to charge your devices without needing to be plugged into anything. So essentially it's like a portable charger. Now with it being portable, that means you can take this, put it anywhere you want to in the room. So I can just have it right here. It's not gonna be an issue whatsoever. I don't need to have it near an outlet. That is great for designing your room and having a really cohesive look without having that black cable. What's also nice is if you just wanna take this thing somewhere else completely, maybe a friend's house, you can do that. It's actually really easy to take apart and assemble. Uh, honestly, I was really surprised when we first put it together. All you need to do is really screw in the three legs that it comes with and it's a one and done kind of process. So not only does this thing have a crazy loud Bluetooth speaker with some great sound quality, but it also has that built-in battery so that you can move this thing around, take it wherever you'd like, can place it right here, and charge up my devices without having a cable plugged in. But check this out, guys. I know you see this little symbol over here. See this right here? Something wireless, right? Well, you can just throw your phone down, Boom. The thing also has wireless charging built right into it. Can you imagine having people over, someone just places their phone down on here, walk away and they're like, wait a minute, why is my phone charged? Imagine that. 
Uh, but it's cool because you don't need any cables. It's, it's just a nice feature to have. And it's something you would not expect in a coffee table that looks like this or a side table that looks like this. Cause this thing looks like it's not super techy, but it really does have all the features you'd kind of want from it. Now, while this is an absolutely awesome side table, now we gotta talk about the price. You knew it was coming. This thing goes for 220 bucks. Now, I don't know how many of you badly need a side table with a Bluetooth speaker and portable charger inside of it. And honestly, I wish this thing was a hundred bucks less. If it were a hundred dollars less, insta buy, insta cop, you have to get it. It's just great. So for me, it's a little bit overpriced if you don't have that specific need. I don't think anyone really does, but that does not take away from the fact that it is just an awesome, awesome piece of tech and I genuinely really like it. I just wish it didn't cost so much. So that is why this is going to be the first item on our awesome but overpriced tech list, the Sierra Modern Home Side Table thing. It's dope though. Malcolm, would you buy this? You would, oh, okay. Jay, would you buy this? See, Jay says it has some a little wiggling thing going on. I don't, I don't really see, oh, I guess if you tip on one side too much, maybe stability, that's something. I've never reviewed a side table before, <laughs> so I'm sorry if I didn't mention that. Okay, so Jay, Jay says no, Malcolm undecided because he's flip-flopping on his answer. <laughs> uh, I like it a lot. I'm, I'm a huge techie, so I think it's great, but I want to know what you guys think. Uh, if you pick this up, I think you'll enjoy it. If you've got the money for it, you'll absolutely enjoy it but it is expensive. Let me know what you guys think and what you think of this series. Are you interested in hearing more about cool tech that I think is just a little bit too pricey? Let me know with a comment down below what you think of this new series and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Links to this will be down below in the description, of course, if you wanna check it out. Uh, but until the next video, guys, it's your average consumer. Peace.